Welcome back or hello to those who are new to this channel. Just wanted to sit down and do a quick chat before this vlog starts. I think as a as an introvert, this is still very awkward to be speaking my voice and recording this sit down video, but I just wanted to be a little bit more personal. I've been feeling some feelings, a lot of feelings actually this month. I've kind of been hit with the February blues. I think I was feeling a lot of anxiety and feeling very demotivated without me realizing on a day-to-day -day basis. I have been unconsciously trying to fight against that voice that always seems to creep into my mind with like negativity. And so seeing the footage made me feel like there was still a lot of love and I realized that I need to be just more kind to myself, just be okay with not knowing where I'm going and being okay with not constantly being productive. I think I just need to do less comparison and I just need to be more true to myself and that's the most authentic I can get. I hope you guys still find comfort through this vlog where it's just really a documentation of me trying to find peace and joy in the little things. Uh, yeah, but I hope you guys enjoy this video.
So are you like still planning it? Yeah, I'm trying to like get it all set up because I'm trying to make it like a real business. Oh yeah, do you want to take a selfie in here? Oh, yes, please. Mm. Hello, this is my outfit for today. Still have to layer because it's so cold, but wearing my corduroy pants and also these cute shoes that I thrifted. Heading to a cafe today. I think being home has been very unproductive. So I'm gonna head to a cafe so I can get some work done. Figuring out like what kind of YouTube content to create more and to journal a little bit. I think I've been feeling a little out of touch with kind of the reasons for my anxiety and just feeling uneasy this month. So needing to get to just touching base with myself a little bit more, um, but yeah. We'll head to the cafe together. So it's nighttime now. I think in January, the fact that it was a new year, it made it feel like a new start, a new beginning. I had all these goals when I wasn't really meeting those expectations, like waking up early, journaling every day. I was being really hard on myself and kind of feeling like I was failing. I realized that for myself, I don't let anything slide. I think that's why I work really, really hard in whatever I do, but then I get burned out really easily. So I think that that's kind of um, what was happening. Today, I decided to be kind to myself. And even though I struggled to 
achieve my wake up at 7 a.m. I was just thankful that I was able to wake up and start a new day. I went to a cafe, enjoyed my pastry, my coffee, and reflected over all the thoughts and emotions that were keeping me up every night the past two weeks. Really being attentive, putting in daily effort every single day to give myself positive affirmations and continually learning to love myself more and also learning to respect myself just as I would to other people. But yeah, good night. Good morning. Just got ready. I'm heading out to meet a friend for lunch. It's Saturday and this is my little outfit that I'm wearing. Gray jeans. Got this vintage top. Very Y2K. And then just got my Uggs on. I'll also be wearing a puffer over this. My handy dandy long puffer. 